hi guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for coming back please if you're new to my channel subscribe like and comment on my videos I really appreciate your support today we're gonna make spinach and melon seed stew so if you're ready let's get started So everything you need for this stew is sitting right there on the counter. You're going to need spinach, nicely sliced, tomato, onion, ginger, everything blended, and a little bit of bell pepper. You're going to need oil, and I'm also using mushrooms, tomato paste, melon seeds, sliced onion, everything, and then of course your seasoning to taste. I'm going to list everything in the description box and the quantity, so if you missed this, please check it out. At this point, our pan has been heating on the stove for like 5 minutes. It's hot so we put in the oil, we heat it up for a little bit, we add in the onion and then we fry for like maybe 5 minutes. And once it's golden brown, we add in our tomato paste, we stir it in. And then I always like to add in my seasoning, I love the aroma that gives. So you add in your seasoning, you fry for a minute or so, you add in your blended pepper, ginger and all that. You add it in, cover and let it simmer for 10 minutes. Just keep an eye on stirring every now and then and as you can see the oil is coming to the top so now I added in the Maggi seasoning, my last seasoning and then cook it for a minute or so and then I added in my mushrooms, stir it in, cover and let it cook for another two minutes or so. Look at how beautiful it looks already. It's coming along beautifully and it smells amazing. Like I'm not kidding. So next I'm adding in big mackerels and big turkey. I'm gonna cover and let it simmer down so I can get the flavor and beautiful smell into the meat and the fish. This looks delicious. And you see how red that looks? And I didn't even use palm oil. I never use palm oil. I rarely use palm oil. I'm not a big fan. So I use regular oil and it looks just as beautiful and it tastes just as good. So what I'm doing right now is mixing some chicken stock with the melon seed. I always do that, just an added flavor. It doesn't hurt, you know, extra flavor. So, and I use the spoon, or Nathan is, and put a little little bit of it all over the stew because I like to have some chunks of melon seeds in the stew. Cover and let it cook for about five minutes and then I check to make sure everything is going well. I move it around, I stir it gently. Then I add in my spinach, I cover and I cook till it's nice and wilted just like this and there's chunks of melon seeds in there. You just can't see it but it looks amazing. Just look at it. Oh, it smells amazing and it tastes amazing look at it look at the turkey the fish absolutely delicious and that was it guys it's done i'm gonna plate it we decided to eat it with plantain you can eat it with rice potato yam but i had plantain on hand so that's what we did and look at it beautiful see a little bit of plantain lots of stew you know Thank you guys. I'm going to show you another look close up. 360 turn. You know I love my 360 turns. Yay. You know. I, I like to tease you a little bit at the end. So look. It's beautiful. And of course my boy was going to taste it. So here we go. What do you think Nathan? Come on. Waiting. Don't keep me waiting. I like. I like it because it's a little bit spicy, but not too spicy. Well, that's it guys. He's right. It was amazing. Give it a try and leave a comment. Subscribe to my channel. Like and until next time, smile. See miracles in life every day. Bye guys.